Hi, it's Jim Macaluso from Technique Peak, and today I would like to discuss some hands-on neuromuscular re-education of the shoulder. Uh, many of our shoulder patients have difficulty with proper shoulder mechanics and tend to have a positive shrug sign. So this is a good technique to do hands-on with the patient prior to having them do their independent scaption and active and resistive shoulder exercises. Okay, so what I'd like to do with Donis is work with him here and first initiate a little shoulder retraction and depression so that he promotes more upward rotation of that scapula as opposed to an upward shrug. Okay, Donis, please retract and depress your shoulders or pinch them down and back. Okay, and then let's do your shoulder flexion up and over your head with the external rotation at end range. Good. Okay, and relax the shoulders. Good, okay, pinch down and back. Lift and turn your hand with me. So I'll start out just guiding them and pinch down and back, and then I'll add some resistance. Push up into my hand, yep, good, and bring it down. And then if they're having difficulty with it, it's a little difficult with your hand placements, but I will give them some tactile input. Donis, pinch your shoulder down and back, and I'll give him some anterior force into that shoulder blade so that he has to hold it down and back into my hand and actually feel the motion. Okay, and then lift and turn. So it takes a little difficulty with your body mechanics, but sometimes with the patients who are having trouble getting it, this is very successful. Pinch down and back. Come on up, all the way up, okay? And one more time, and now what we'll do is pinch down and back, lift up against my resistance. Okay, now hold, and we're gonna add some rhythmic stabilization near the end of range, okay? As we had learned in the course last year on the shoulder, what Wilk recommends is doing three to five reps, okay, shoulders down and back, and lift with resistance, and then adding the rhythmic stabilization at the end for good hands-on strengthening with proper motion prior to doing their independent active exercises and PREs out in the clinic. Once again, this is Jim Macaluso from Technique Peak.